Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can upload a code onto your Arduino Uno board so that you can start sensing and reading things in the environment. So first of all I want to give credits to this website, Circuits Today, because all of the code as well as the diagrams are coming from this particular website, so thank you very much. Also, um, you need to open up the Arduino IDE. So in the search bar, search up the Arduino IDE and open it up. As it's loading, go ahead and scroll all the way down to where it says analog code. And I want you to scroll within the small window all the way up. And you need to highlight everything there and copy it. Once you do that, go to the Arduino IDE. You'll see a window It says Sketch. This is uh, where you're going to copy your code into the sketch. So delete everything in that window and copy and paste there. Um, we need to change a couple of the numbers here because this code was written for a slightly different sensor. So instead of 550, I want you to put 1023. Basically, this number is the largest number that our sensor can read, and that's why we need to change that number there. Also, let's change the spelling of moisture here so that um, when it when we read it, it's, it's correct. Once you've finished fixing those two things, go ahead and click on Verify. Give it a name. I'm just going to call mine Moisture Sensor and then put your group name, or group member's name, and then click Save. All right, and you can see down here, your Arduino is talking to you. So right here, if there's any errors in the code or something's wrong, it's going the computer's gonna talk to you here and say there's something wrong. And in our case, there's nothing wrong, so it says it's done compiling, so we're good to go. At this point, you need to plug in your Arduino into the USB port on your computer. And then you're going to click on Upload. Now before you click on Upload, go to Tools and make sure that your board is selected as the Arduino Uno and that your port is selected as the Arduino Uno as well. If it's not, it's not going to upload. Then click on the button Upload, and what that does is it sends this code to your Arduino, and you should see your Arduino blinking at this point. Once it finishes, you are good to go. Your soil moisture sensor is already taking readings. The way you see the readings is you need to go to Tools, go to Serial Monitor, and you can see here um, mine is... Mine is not in water at all. It's completely dry, so you can see the moisture is at 0%. Once you get to this point, call me over so I can check and give you a grade. Thanks.